fellow Cancer. Thank you for clicking on my channel and welcome to the journey home. My name is Catherine and I live in Nova Scotia. This is your November forecast. Any year that you might click on it. Uh, whatever has pulled you to that. This reading will hopefully resonate for you. There's also an autumn forecast that's out. If you want to check that out, check the description or the channel. And we go live every Sunday night to pull free cards for the party in the chat, 4 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Again, in the description, let's start with your November, Cancer. We have the Tower. We started off with Aries this way as well, which may be indicative of something for some of you. This Tower, uh, most people feel, is just well, drama. Terrible things happening. Tearing down the old house to build a new house. This could be about moving, relocating, new jobs. Or things beyond maybe your control that are happening around you as they are on the world stage. It's, you know, shocking a lot of people lately. And we're needing to rebuild. We have victory. Conquering. The chariot this is your card cancer coming into full power despite whatever that tower might mean for you uh, you have a lot of left brain thinking even though cancers can be very sensitive and emotional you're showing a real sense of strength in the month of November being able to balance multitask I think in the efforts that you are putting in in the month of November is going to there's going to be something revealed to you that ends a cycle coming full circle here ending a cycle so interesting that this would come where you've got the tower and the end of a cycle For some of you, there may be a loss, someone passing, or ill and needs care. Something revealed to you that ends a cycle. There seems to be cancer like this busy period, but balancing it. balancing it being victorious being very strong here a lot of problem solving left brain thinking grounded energy help spiritual help well when help is needed the most who comes nobody steps up to the plate and it looks to me like Cancer, this is something you've got to do alone. I'm not saying you have to be single or you're going to be single. I'm saying that whatever this is, that disruption, that ending of a cycle is... No help for you. You're doing this on your own. Um, there's a strong sense of divine guidance here we have the lovers on strength that your love will see someone who is going through a terrible time you are going to be able to lay your own burdens down and there's some healing here but it could be someone who feels betrayed or was betrayed that your caring for I, I i want to i was going to say nurturing but it doesn't feel so much like nurturing as it feels like caring someone 
hurt that you pick up. You're tired of juggling. You're tired of um, the discontentment around you. But what is revealed? Oh my. Pisces, Aquarius energy, and of course the moon, uh, Cancer energy as well. What is revealed? It would seem like your hopes, your dreams, and your wishes are being hidden from you. You may feel in the month of November that it will never come to pass. Not so. Not so. This protective energy around you, you are almost at completion with the end of a cycle. And I'm going to pull a couple of more. What does this mean with the lovers and the strength? Someone from the past. This feels cancer like Um, be careful that you don't judge somebody that doesn't deserve to be judged. You may feel they need to be judged. But you may not hear, this is what's hidden. There's the whole story. You may not know all of the facts. And you may be judging based on their actions or non-actions. If that makes any sense to you. Let's have a look at love specifically. What's the message for cancer regarding love? Ah, uh, so there's someone that you may be getting to know. Or maybe you went through... Maybe you're going to go through a cycle that's ending and having to rebuild a relationship, an existing relationship with cancer after a rough period. Unrequited love. So someone from the past coming back into your life. Codependency. You've been around this circle before. Repeating a pattern. You may have to take a look at how certain behaviors you ha have are affecting a relationship or them. This could be vice versa. Unrequited and codependency. Now, interesting that it's sandwiching this card, getting to know each other as you reveal innermost selves, your innermost selves, your bond will deepen. A better understanding perhaps cancer, if this ends up going by the wayside, this person from the past and is put back in the past, a way of reconciling with yourself as to what happened, why it happened, what can change what happened for future reference. You or this person still wants to work at this. They still want to work at this. So that will be your task in the month of November for some of you. I hope that resonated. Check the descriptions below for those autumn forecasts for you, as well as joining me live or get a personal reading for $25 to check it out. Thanks for joining me, Cancer. God bless. Bye-bye for now.